My name is Milenko Mike Gergic, president of Gergic Hills Winery in Rutherford, California. And I have been in touch with the Zifander, uh, Plavats Mali, all this story which conference is now discussing all my life because I had a vineyard in Croatia that was Plavats Mali. And uh, when I came to America, I, in the August 1958, I saw vineyards around the sovereign cellars, and I was interested to, to know who, which grapes are grown there. And it was one vineyard, they told me, that vineyard is Cabernet Sauvignon, it originally came from France. The another vineyard is Zinfandel, but nobody knows where grapes came from. Yeah, try to look at the camera, but it's perfect. Yes, very good. So th that I will just talk about my idea what is important to connect in one unit. It's a first that when I came to Nampa Valley and I discovered that there is a grapes called the Zinfandel and that nobody knew where it came from. And in my mind, that was kind of the interest whether anybody will discover where that Zimmer came from. But looking at the grapes in Upper Valley called Zimmer remind me of the Plavatsmali grapes in Croatia. And I really thought that they are the same. And so when I came back from America, I took with me the clusters of Zinfandel leaves, even cane, in a box with idea that I'll compare when I come to Croatia to find out myself whether those Zivandel is the same as Plavac Mali in Croatia. When I came back to Croatia, I, they looked to me very similar, but I was not sure that they are identical. That's what came with idea to contact Dr. Carol Meredith at the University of Davis, who is an expert in varietals, in research of varietals. And when I came back to Napa Valley, I called her, and she came to my house in Yantville, and I told her the, some news that I found in Croatia, that Zinfandel, Italian Primitivo and Plavac Mali are the same grape. I suggested to her that she might use her knowledge and experience to find out the really where Zinfandel came from, where Zinfandel came from, and uh, she uh, did understand and became very susceptible to continue 
talking about the subject. And when she came back to the Davis, she talked to her assistant, Yasin Kapiwas, that she talked with my Grish about Zimfand and the roots of Zimfand. And Yasin said, I know my Grish because he's crossing like me. Right? Dr. Meredith was very happy to hear that he's Croatian. I asked her, do you speak Croatian language? And she said, yes, I do. I was born in Croatia and educated in Croatia. And that came to her mind that she might decide to go to Croatia and take Piers and Capillas as an interpreter. And search of the roots of Zinfandel together. And so when they came to Croatia, they been joined with Professor Edi Maletic from University of Zagreb and another professor, Ivan Page, and they looked at the Plavat Smali and she was very excited when she saw the huge vineyard of Plavas Mali, she thought uh, what a lot of Zinfandel. However, she didn't know that exactly until she came back home and analyzed with DNA testing and did not find the roots of Zinfandel. But she left Eddie Maletic and Ivan Page to continue in search, especially on the territories that she, she didn't cover. And somehow their research found one grape that they thought that might be a, a roots of Zimbabwe, called Zelenak Karstalansky. And when samples came from Davis, first time the people who sampled took the wrong sample and so they repeated this sample and it has been very happy Dr. Meredith that she finally see the roots of Zimbabwe that they found out Selena Karstelansky is same as American Zimbabwe. So that was results of the search up to this point that they find out Selena Karstelansky and she was testing with DNA testing and she was happy that was identical with California Zimbabwe. And from then on, the no, Zimbabwe was not forgotten, neither America, neither Plavac Mali in Croatia. They are flourishing. And Zimbabwe was so accepted in California that when I came 58 in California, was more acreage under Zimbabwe than any other red variety. And that Zinfandel was part of that sh shipped to the East in another states that they made homemade wines from Zinfandel. So Zinfandel become very acceptable as a good wine and uh, that has been Interested, interesting to find out really where the roots of Zinfandel 
arrived to California. And this which we talked about proved that research was done, the roots has been found, and now they are celebrating on this conference uh, achievement about the Zirvadel and uh, research was proven that Zinfandel in old days had different names. Pribidrag, even 15 centuries before, it was called Pribidrag. And this conference is going to consider Pribidrag and Zinfandel and all these achievements which we now know and uh, makes me happy that interest into Zinfandel and Pribidrag did not disappear. That is still alive and uh, this conference is going to consists of the winemakers, wine writers, researchers in the world, and a historical conference that will resurface the value of Zimandel and Pribidrak.